This Memorial Day, we're paying tribute to the men and women who put their lives on the line for our freedom. The Heartland Honor Flight takes veterans to Washington, D.C. to see the memorials built in their honor. And recently, for the first time, the group had a sacred ceremony for their brothers in arms killed in Vietnam. KNBC 9's Rob Hughes shows us this special moment in our nation's capital. John Robert Zoni, Warren Edward Keck, Tommy Heal. Not far from the Vietnam Memorial in Washington, D.C., Kansas City area veterans read the names and tell the stories of their friends etched on the wall. He was a flight surgeon, Jerry Wayne Kirkendall, very close friend of mine. Miss him. Veterans salute the men who served and died together. Joe Tricky that was just announced. The two of them were in the same plane crash and died together. All four of them were hit in one shot. Died in a plane accident. Lawrence W. Scanlon, he was there one day. He was a mechanic and he uh, got shot by a sniper working on a plane. Captain John Peacock, North Vietnam, August 12th, 1972, along with his bombardier, First Lieutenant William Price and Captain Ralph Chipman. The ceremony ends with taps. <laughs> As Heartland Honor Flight veterans, volunteers, and guardians pay tribute to the lives behind the names etched in stone and our hearts forever. Michael A. Montalan, Jerry Lee Newman, Harold Kenneth Southwick, Rob Hughes, KBC 9 News. This Memorial Day, we're asking for your support to send more local veterans to Washington. Heartland Honor Flight is funded entirely by donations, so you could scan the QR code here on your screen to donate or head to heartlandhonorflight.org to support that cost. A Missouri nun who died for...